Hello everyone, today I am going to do a quick unbox of this multimeter Sanwa CD800A digital multimeter. Here is the back of this paper box. Here is a barcode number which has the information of that this is a Japanese product. It says global standard. Okay, let's let's try to open it. Inside the front cover there is another box here is the other okay let's open the multimeter here is the multimeter Inside the box, we have a manual book and a calibration certificate tested and verified by Sanwa. Okay, take this apart. I will tell the description after open the altimeter ok let's open the cover it says here open here is the protective case This case is very nice, build quality is very good, Sanwa branded, very nice looking. You can use this as a tilted stand, like put this back in there, then slide this a little bit, like this. Let's start from the back. In the back it says Tokyo Japan. Maybe this one is manufactured in Japan or assembled in China. I'm not sure but in the original version here is a seal that says made in japan but this one don't have okay, one thing i have noticed the original version comes with a paper card that has the qr code to download the pc link app this one doesn't have this okay let's open the battery cover it has metal threaded insert very nice Okay. The 
the screw is not locked it comes nice screw there here is the case battery case maybe it's plastic okay here is the fuse compartment you can change it if damaged nice fuse this one is not a glass fuse you can replace it it has another compartment there to get used to it maybe this one is a SRC fuse 0 0.5 amp to 50 volt fuse max cell battery 1.5 volt double a battery okay now let's put this back in there it is very nice it took a little bit forced to open okay the plastic some I used here is very nice quality actually very nice plastic build quality is so good very nice feel to the touch design casting is very nice range switch feels very good very clicky too I played with this range switch several times it feels very good and ok good enough it feels like little bit play there hydraulic types okay put this back cover there The cables are okay, where is the reading? Two thousand volt twenty four AWG eighty degree centigrade nice soft cable tips are good enough Sanwa branded actually TL61TA model number CAT 3600 volt but I don't see any types of strain relief this is very surprising like these types of multimeter we should expect at least strain relief there the tips are not standard maybe they are not rubberized but nice gold plated very good quality tip I'll do a continuity test later ok let's do and talk about this multimeter with the specifications it comes with
I got this accuracy section DC volt 400 millivolt range has 0.7 percent accuracy 0.7 percent reading plus 3 digit count and 4 volt to 600 volt range it has plus minus 1.1 percent reading plus 3 digit count but the their website says overall range has 0.7 percent accuracy that means 400 millivolt to 600 volt range it has 0.7 percent accuracy but what the heck is going on there i don't know on point down percent this is auto range then you can select this is in dc mode now in ac mode now back in dc range select now in millivolt range then 4 volt range then 40 volt range and then 400 then 600 it's very nice then auto ranging mode you have to push this this button uh, maybe two seconds to get the auto ranging mode then this is the relative value mode data hold mode and this is frequency and uh, duty cycle okay now in oh, home range in this range you can measure resistance diode you can test diodes continuity test you can test capacitance too one thing you have to do is to is to press the select button now in uh, resistance home range now diode testing mode now continuity testing mode and now capacitance testing mode okay now back in home mode To test a resistor, there is a accuracy of 1.5% reading plus 5 digit count for the range of 400 ohm, then for 4k up to 4 meg, it has sorry, 4 sorry. 4k to 400k it has a accuracy of plus minus 1.2 percent reading plus 5 digit count then for 4 mega ohm range it has 2.0 percent reading plus 3 digit count and then the ultimate range of 40 mega ohm it has plus minus 4.0 percent accuracy that means 4.0 percent reading plus plus 3 digit count for testing capacitor it has a it has an accuracy of 5.0 percent up to 50 nanofarad to 100 microfarad so it is very limited you cannot measure capacitance over 100 microfarad it has 0.5 percent accuracy in the frequency mode duty cycle 20 to 80 percent plus minus 0.5 percent accuracy it can measure up to 400 milliampere because it has a fuse of 0.5 ampere DC current measurement accuracy 2.2 percent 
AC current measuring accuracy 2.2% reading plus 5 digit count up to 400 milliampere for testing diodes open voltage approximately DC 1.5 volt okay Here is the range of frequency test and duty cycle. Mm, then you got current testing range. Okay. This has auto power saving mode for 30 minutes. So overall this is a very good multimeter for beginners not for big measurement only for low voltage measurement this is a very good multimeter for DC voltage measurement this one has basic accuracy of 0.7% so this is good enough So yeah, overall build quality is very nice. This is a very reputed Japanese brand, Sanwa. It has also a calibration certificate. So all the accuracy was tested and will be well in its spec, I hope. Okay, I hope this video will help you to recover and to know things about this multimeter. I will do some test and accuracy test later. If you like my video, then please subscribe to my channel and like this video. Thank you guys.